Hey everyone, it's Murfra. Anyway, um, I am doing a video to respond to um, Luca. Isn't Luca's call for video responses? Um, she has nine questions that she wants people to answer, so that's what I'm doing. Um, question number one is: When did you first access the internet? I believe it was my senior year in college, which would have been 1994. Um, I personally didn't have internet access. My um, One of my friends across the hallway did. And uh, we used it. I don't even know what we used it for. I, general email, I think. It was just like basic, basic stuff back then. Um, and then when I moved into my own apartment um, at the end of 94, then I got myself a modem and hooked up the computer. So it was in, the, in 94, 95 when I started using it. And again, it was just pretty much email to talk to people. And um, at that time, I think that was pretty much it. I didn't do much surfing the internet. I talked to people um, a lot. Back then, chat rooms were really big. Um, I mean, I know they probably are still now, but I don't do them as much. Um, I have different uses for the internet now. Um, number two, how old were you? Well, 1994 was when I graduated college, so I would have been 22 and 23. 22, 23. I've always used computers, though. I mean, I was I took my first computer class back in the summer after fifth grade, and then when we had um, computers introduced into my school in the sixth grade, I kind of helped the teacher out. So, computers has always been something that it's like second nature to me now. Number three, what did you download? I don't think I downloaded anything for a while. Um, back then, the modems were so slow. And I don't even think I thought of the internet as that used for that then. Um, so I don't think I did that only thing. Um, you know, and I don't know. I really don't know what to tell you. What's the longest time you've known an individual person outside of family? Does that include, is, when you're saying family, are you including family friends who have always been involved in family events? Because if that's, if you are not including them, it would be my mother's best friend, Dottie, who's been part of our family ever since I was a wee lass. But um, if you don't want me to include her because she is actually family, part of the family, even though not blood relative, I guess I'd have to say my friend Kurt. Um, I've known him since elementary school. Um, yeah, it would have to be Kurt. And now we e email each other and stuff, but yeah. Um, have you ever met someone from the internet? I did once. When I was back again, when I was living in my first apartment. And I had met, I met a guy. We went on a date, we went dancing. Um, but that was it. You know, I haven't done that again since, so... It was, I mean, it was fun, and it ended up turning out okay. It was a stupid thing to do in retrospect, so, um, you know, I didn't, I wasn't really bright back then. Well, not, I, I've always been bright, but I just wasn't, I was, I've always been naive, but I was a lot more naive then, let's put it that way. Anyway, number six, can you write a haiku? Hey. Um, that was my Twitter thingy, so, um, I probably could write a haiku. I have a problem with writing poetry that either rhymes or has any kind of structure to it. My poetry tends to be very unstructured. So um, I could if I really focused, but it would be very stilted. Um, the way I write has to just come from within, and that's it. I can't try and put it into a form, or it just sounds stupid. And I do have a lot of poetry. Uh, maybe someday I'll read some of it to you. It's very personal, though, so we'll have to see about how much coin money do you have now? Well, I'm not going to count for you, Ruthie. I love you, but I have a big vase, a glass vase, that had flowers in it at my dad's memorial, and I've been trying to fill it to the top with pennies in order to um, donate to the American Lung Association in his memory um, since he died from COPD, emphysema. Um, so I'm still trying to fill the vase up, but it's a lot of pennies and I really don't want to help them right now. Plus, I've got a bag of pennies at work that um, a co-worker gave me for the same purpose. So, uh, 
I can't even venture a guess. I know in my wallet I've got ten cents. So if that's what if that counts, then that's what that is. Choose a Star Universe, Star Wars, Star Trek, and Star. Well, definitely not Star Trek. I can't stand it. <laughs> Bad memories. I don't know what Stargate is, so I'll have to go with Star Wars. I don't know what is Stargate. I get, uh, maybe it's because I'm old <laughs> that I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, and finally, what question will you ask of me? Um, oh my God, I should have thought about this, huh? Hmm. Maybe I don't know. Let's see. What is your favorite childhood memory? I like that one. All right, Ruthie. Hope you're happy. See ya.